Thank you all for joining me and welcome back to the Planet Crafter. So we're currently waiting for the actual to unlock the tier five, tier five, tier four, I thought so, tier five uh, heater. Um, and uh, yeah, and I'm also trying to get the pressure up as well because we've got to go get quite far on that one. Uh, Thirty eight something, I think we need to get to. Uh, we only need to get to eight point three zero on that to unlock the tier five. Now, yes, I could have actually got uh, these going. Uh, which would actually greatly increase the pressure uh, but I wanted to test out and check out how you know the tier 5 heater obviously so and that was going to be the first thing that we're going to be able to unlock anyway so we're going to do that and then I wanted to see what kind of uh, recipe it is for it what we're going to need uh, now with that we are going to need osmium which we have got uh, but obviously I've got a funny feeling that maybe with the new rod that we've got the uh, osmium rod we might need that which is going to cost quite a lot it's going to cost nine osmium just to make one rod so we may have to be able to make one but as you can see here you've got pressure it's pressure 35.5 seconds and it's quite a big jump from tier three uh, that's uh, 0 0.6 all the way to the tier four which is 35.5 5. so yeah that is actually going to help a little bit with the pressure now i have been actually oh i think we should have unlocked it now that popped up um where are you why is it not popped up there we go new blueprint received heater tier five awesome uh so i have been sending up rockets anyway for the pressure as well so so yeah so the tier five which is here so here it is so that's actually going to give us pressure of 280 that's actually quite a big jump from the actual tier um three uh, and in fact the energy is 360 so we should be able to get two of those in fact i'm, I'm not i've not been keeping an eye on this we've actually got enough there anyway but we might have to get more power eventually so let's see how much that's actually going to cost us oh actually that's actually not too bad well it's a super alloy rods though we need three of those whoa super alloy rods i don't think we've actually got any we might have one actually super alloy rods yeah okay so we need three super alloy rods which means we're going to three six eight uh, 16 24 super uh, um, super alloy right let's sort that out then and um, we're also going to need what we're going to need for that is we're also going to need free explosive powder i think we might have free explosive powder we should be okay on the rods i might have to make a couple more like but we should be good on that so let's go and sort that out which may, which is a good thing because it means we can actually get some more of those drills going which is great going to hopefully greatly increase the pressure so that we can actually because i really do want to actually get that unlocked wherever it is <laughs> uh, the actual um is it the tier four tier three i think it's the tier three um extractor where we can actually choose what we actually extract so we can actually see how that's actually gonna work all right let's have a look at the explosive things because i'm sure i made some yeah uh, we only need three of those uh, we're also going to need a super alloy rods, but I don't think we've actually got any. Uh, I'll have to double check everywhere. Um, super alloy rods, super alloy rods. In fact, let's just check. I think we need three iridium rods, don't we? And I think we've got that. So one, two, and three. There we go. Do you know what? Let's do that oh, right now. So we need those three now. And now we just need the super alloy rods to be able to make that, <clears throat> which I don't think we've got. So we are going to need three aluminium for that. So one, two, and three. And um, we're gonna need a lot of these. So we're gonna need eight for each one. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven. Eight, okay, I just wanna make sure and get the right amount of what we need now i need another eight now how much is that store two four six eight there we go so if i just do that let that do its thing we should have enough stuff for all that let that make that and then when we come back that should be full um and i'll go down and i'll actually make the super alloy rods i don't think we can actually make the super alloy rods here can we i don't think we can actually let's have a look Oh, we can actually make the super alloy rods here. I didn't realise. Right, let's wait for this then. And we'll make the super alloy rods here then. I, I forgot to check here. Yeah, of course you can. Awesome. So, what we'll do then is I might as well put everything back then. <laughs> oh, my God. Right, let's just put those in there. Those in there. 
put the uh, aluminium back in there. Well, this makes things a bit more simpler, doesn't it, I guess? Uh, yeah, those will get used up anyway, I'm hoping, because uh, they're closer. Uh, so if I just come out of here and um, we'll go to the super alloy rods Won't be able to make it yet. I'll take that out There we go. I just need three of those. I just need to drop them in there I was not using these for some reason. Oh, no, I need those. Oh, no, no, no. I need those. Don't I? Yeah, sorry my bad. That's for the actual things in it. <laughs> Oh dear. Right, okay, there's so many things going on. Uh, right, the thing is though, where can I actually build this thing? Um, so, it's probably going to be pretty huge, which uh, makes sense. So we might have to have this outside somewhere. In fact, I don't even think it's going to fit there, is it? Really big. Holy moly, that's huge. Uh, why is it going to let me do it there? I'll be, I'm not going to put it there though, of course. Uh, yeah, right. Uh, let's see where we're going to actually put this. Uh, I think maybe somewhere around there somewhere. Oh, really? Just I'm about to put something big outside. This will go out here though, won't it? Uh, hold on a minute. Oh, God. Is this a, just a storm or is it uh, an actual meteor? I think it's a... Oh, water warning go outside anyway thing is though have a look so let me put it on the floor I don't think it will I think it's got to be on a thing I wonder if it'll let me put it on. I, I wish it would let me put it on here oh it would let me put it on the floor interesting okay well actually yeah that makes sense I guess uh, new blueprint received butterfly. Oh, a new butterfly larva. We might have to see if we can get that sorted today uh, and get another one of those going on. The butterfly things that I actually thought was a uh, beehive thing. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, I think I actually want it on the actual foundations over here. So let's go back over here and see if I can actually find a really good place. It, the thing is, though, the bigger the things I get, the harder they are to place because you just don't. It's hard to gauge it. Oh, I mean, that is huge, absolutely huge. Yeah, it's not going to go there, is it? it really? Oh, hold on, we get it there. Uh, yeah, I suppose we could put it there, and I think I might actually move it eventually. I think we're going to have to do some more building, which is not a problem. But I think for now, we'll just put that there. Oh my God, look at the size of that thing! Jeez. That is huge. Right, we're going to have to find a better place for that. But, uh, yeah, in fact, have I, I haven't got any iron on me, though, have I? Right. Uh, what are you? You're, not, you're just a common. Uh, right, so let's check. Oh, hold on. This side. Let's go and check uh, the pressure now. So, I mean, obviously, it's not going to go up that fast. Uh, but uh, we are actually going to start doing some more drills because we have got enough for all that although we are going to have to make some more um, of these so we need six uh, super alloy to go with that so we'll actually go and start that off now hopefully we'll have enough stuff for that might be able to get a couple of those done um, so we'll see so let's get some super alloy um, could have just carried on with that can't we really but never mind so we can get that done and uh, yeah, and greatly increase the pressure, hopefully. So one, two, three, four, five, six. For now, I'm just going to go with six because obviously we've got to get the super alloy done. And obviously it's uh, going to take all these resources from us as well. So what do we need? Eight, don't we? No, six. I think we need six, don't we? I'm going to let, 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 this, let this run. Uh, so we've got two, four, six. So we've got six there. So let's go and get the first one down and then we can see how much of a big difference that makes to the pressure. Uh, so let's have a look at the pressure at the moment. Now the pressure is at uh, 367115. 367115. Okay, so we did have one over here that I actually dismantled because I needed the actual stuff. 367115. So let's see if we can actually get back in place here. 
six seven one one five and that yeah it's it makes sense that that's actually going to make a big bigger difference with the drill for the pressure but obviously like i said i wanted to make sure we had enough to actually make one of the heaters in fact we don't really need the heaters at the moment i don't think there's anything that is actually going to be unlocked from the heat no so we don't really need that i mean yeah it would be good to get the heat up because of actually getting the gti up so let's go and get that pressure up uh, in fact, what do we, what else is next on there? Oh yeah, we've got the inset spreader rocket, which would be a good thing to get. We've got to get that to seventeen point seven, and then there is actually there is actually a drill tier five that we've got to get to, which is at twenty nine on the biomass. So we are going to have to keep an eye, we're going to have to keep going with that. But wow, is that the one we've actually just unlocked? And that's one thousand percent. And then we've got the one more to unlock there. Um, that's at 22.1 right let's go and see if we can actually go and sort out another drill so we can get this pressure going and uh yeah as you can see i've actually started destroying these in fact it's probably a good idea to destroy those as well uh so i've actually already got those on me Anna. so let's uh let's grab them i don't think we can make any more i think we've run out of some stuff uh which is oh no it's still going yay which means i'm gonna have a lot to do later on so I want to get another drill going. Maybe even another one, because we've got plenty of um, osmium at the moment, so it's a good thing. So I don't know where I want these drills. I really could do with a better place for them. Uh, in fact, we've got some small drills here, so I'm just going to put them. I'm going to put one here. Why not? Because they are pretty big as well. There we go. Okay, we've got, we have got to keep an eye on our power as well, our power output, because uh, we might need to get another um, nuclear uh, nuclear generator thing. Uh, so that's actually taken our pressure up a lot now uh, So can we get a third one going? Let's just check on our power consumption at the moment. We're actually still doing okay uh, So yeah, so I would like to get that up a bit more That's NPA if I can get that up to P8. That'd be awesome. I don't think we're gonna though, especially not today um, It all depends on how much super alloy we can get done um, Which I don't think we've got one two three four five six. Yep We've got enough there to get another one done. So let's get another one done then. So we need some more osmium, of course, which is here. One, two, three. See, we're okay on osmium. It's super alloy. Uh, what is it that's actually disappeared? In fact, it looks like the aluminium. I'm going to keep that as it is because we do need more of that later on. Uh, let's go and put the other drill in place. In fact, it looks like I'm probably going to need to grab some food that I can eat later on. There we go. We'll have a sip of water on the way out as well. Okay. Let's have a look at this now. Yeah, so that is actually starting to go up. And it's 11.66. It's still not fast enough, though. So, yeah. Uh, but we, we will get there. We will get there. So let's get another one. But that's at 523 now. 523175. I'm not going to remember all them numbers, but if I, if I just remember the first three numbers, 523. There you go. We just went up there. Five, two, three. Okay. I've got some food on me, Anna. Five, two, three. Okay. Can I get another one over here? It'd be good if I can get another one over here. I don't think I will, though. There we go. I can get one just there, lot. Five, two, three. Five two three, and I've got to get out of here. Five two three. Oh. Five two three. So let's check that. That's took us five. So five two three. That's took us up pretty, pretty significantly. So I wouldn't mind. I wouldn't mind getting some more of that. So tell you what, I'm going to wait until the actual this storm's gone. Uh, this uh, meteor strike is gone. And then I'm going to go and see if I can get some more aluminium from somewhere. And then I'll be back and hopefully we can get some more of those done. Uh, I do, I, like I said, I do need to make, kind of make... Oh, well, it looks like it doesn't really take up much. Um, so, yeah. So, two nuclear fusion generators. I mean, we could easily get one of those going, I would have thought. In fact, nuclear generators. Let's have a look. Nuclear generators. Yeah. Well, actually, no. I don't think we've got the pulsar ports for it. But, yeah. We are getting close to being able to craft our own. 
I don't even know what that entails or what it actually costs, but uh, I'm sure we will find out uh, very soon, actually, it looks like. So, yeah, it's a bit loud, guys. So, I'm going to pause it here, guys, and then I'm going to go and try and get some aluminium, see if I can get some more super alloy. In fact, I think we've got a super alloy thing uh, that I can go and check, if I'm not mistaken, but I just can't remember where it is, so I'll be back shortly. Okay, I managed to get some super alloy uh, from over there. It's actually over there. I don't think I actually put a beacon there, but I kind of knew where it was anyway. Uh, it's just over there, just on the left-hand side, a bit further up. There is an outpost there for it. Uh, technically, I don't need any more because we've got oxygen. <laughs> we've got, uh, you know, breathable air now, which is awesome. Uh, so, yeah, and I've just been to see what element we had because I actually did actually fill it up earlier. Uh, let's have a look at this now. That's at 601 now. That's at 601. Oh, yeah, of course it was because we did that other one, didn't we? So we do need a lot more just to get up a lot because we need to get up to a 38 something. 38.3, I think. It, no, no, that was the 8.3 I was thinking of. Um, I don't know. Uh, so we're going to chuck that in there. So we're only going to be able to make three more. Uh, but well, I have got this. So we've got two, four, six, two, four, five. Oh. Six. There we go. Let's stop that a minute. Because we're only going to be able to make two more anyway. So I might as well just leave it at that. So let's just drop all this stuff off that I've got. We've got some iron there. So I'm going to have to start. I actually filled all these up. <laughs> and now we've used them all. But that's what they're there for. So yeah. Might as well. Okay. So we've now going to need um, all this apart from one, I think. So two, four, six for six and we also need so which means we can only do two more drills um so we need one two three one two three and we still got some left so that's good um so yeah and we can actually mine that as well we have actually got a mine for that somewhere aren't we i just can't remember where i don't remember where though but i think we i'm sure we have you know I'm sure we have now, it's going to be interesting if those extractors, you can put them anywhere. So you can put them near your base and you can choose whichever all you want. Now, that's going to make it um, interesting. I think I still prefer to have a certain area for certain ores. Um, just because it actually, you know, makes a difference. I think I'm um, going to come over here and put my bricks. I don't think we're, going to have, we're running out of space over there, aren't we? Uh, I might as well grab this um, from these rockets that I've been... I've not been going around picking them up. Oops. But I do need to. I think there's some over there as well. I'll come back for that. I don't think they disappeared, are they? I don't know if they do or not. So we'll just put them here for now. Um, uh, we've got two of these. That will actually clip into there. Look, I'm not going to clip it all the way in, but do it there. There we go. And then we'll get another one, which will be the final one of the day. Actually, get. There we go. Uh, okay, so we've got two there. So we've actually done quite a lot today because we've actually, in fact, I'm going to go and get that uh, uh, iridium it's here. Uh, we've done quite a lot today because we've done that heater, which is huge, uh, which could actually replace all the others uh, over time. So I might get some more of those done eventually. And uh, yeah, because it makes sense. But the problem is where, <laughs> is where I'm going to put it. Look at the size of that thing. So I'm probably better off getting like a platform going just for the heaters. For those big heaters and that'll give us more room in the base well actually the heaters are in the center aren't they but i don't think they're going to fit there are they so yeah that's the only downside so let's have a look at that those two i mean look at that let's put, put, put it to seven uh, seven five seven so that's actually going to go up pretty fast now not fast enough of course i mean we've got it over 12 since we started and i think it was just over 11 when we got started here today so we'll just have to, I'll, I'll probably do some more. I'll get some more of these uh, drills going. You can actually see it going up now. You're not having to wait too long for it to go up. So that's a good thing. Um, so yeah, uh, what have we got left on the biomass? Well, the biomass is, um, yeah, well, yes, that's it. It's the insect spreader rocket. Um, so that's at 17.7. So yeah, I mean, uh, we're not, we're like halfway there kind of to get that which is going to be a good one to have i think uh yeah it will be because it's a global thing in it but as you can see here like i said i've been doing a lot of the um pressure rockets i could do with sort of like doing these ones as well 
um, just to sort of like even it all out a bit, but it's just not working out that way. So yeah. <laughs> oh anyway anyway guys i am gonna call it here thank you so much for joining me if you enjoyed the content don't forget to like subscribe and click that rusty bell to be informed of future videos and with that take care guys and i will see you in the next video mm -hmm.